Welcome back. In this lesson, we are going to look at playing an A major chord and then moving to an A minor chord. And there are a few techniques we want to do for this transition from an A major to an A minor in particular, but also some general concepts that will help you out playing any chord chords uh, on the guitar or making a transition from one chord to another on the guitar. So the first thing is when we make the A major chord and we're going to move then to the A minor, we want to start to put your hand, fingers into the position of the chord before we play it. In other words, we're going to put our fingers in the position of the A minor chord as we move towards the chord. So in the air, we're going to move our fingers to the new position. And as a general concept, although there are exceptions, it's good to have your index finger be the kind of anchor or the first finger that you're really focused on with your concentration in terms of the new position. So for this chord, we're going to start with the index finger on the second fret of the fourth string, but then we're going to move it to the first fret of the second string. So you can kind of, you can try that just alone, move from the note E here, the second fret of the fourth string, to the note C, which is the first fret of the second string. And you can kind of feel that. And then, so that's one technique, to have that anchor finger or anchor note and move while the shape is moving in the air. And then the other idea is just to play the chord or fret the chord without strumming and really focus on the feeling in your hand for that. And then lift it up and try it again. And then go to the next chord, to the A minor chord, and do the same thing. Kind of squeeze the the, um, the guitar neck without hurting yourself. You don't want to crush the guitar neck, but just kind of gently squeeze it and feel that position in your left hand fingers. And then lift your hand up and then put your hand back and focus for a moment on that position. And then go back to the A major and then slowly try to find that A minor and squeeze it and then go back to the A major and kind of squeeze that gently, and then go back to the A minor and squeeze that. Then you're ready to very slowly try playing the exercise, which will be four strums. You can do down strums on this or down and up strums on the, uh, the A major, and then four strums on the A minor. It will sound like this. So there you have it. Take your time and work on this. And once you get this technique down, it will be much easier to switch between chords for you. And you'll have some techniques to use when you encounter some new chords and add those to your toolbox.